Hello beautiful people, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I've been contemplating uploading this footage for the longest while because of everything that's been happening. It, the energies has just been really heavy. It's been off. And if you're not familiar with what I'm speaking about, uh, recently there was a kidnapping of a young woman she went missing about a week or so ago and there was a nationwide search for her. Uh, several persons, several different organizations went on a hunt to find this woman and she was found approximately a week later after she went missing and unfortunately she was already in an advanced state of decomposition and when I heard when I read the news article, when I saw the videos, when I heard people talking about it, I felt several emotions. At first I couldn't put a name to it, but now I know that it was hurt, it was pain, it was anger, just exhaustion from just being absolutely sick and tired of what's been going on in our country men men have this is nothing new and it just seems to be getting worse men continue to treat women as even lesser than their property as worse than their property because they treat their cars their shoes their clothes their phones better than they treat women and women continue to die at the hands of these men these nasty psychotic narcissistic demonic men and it's it's just really sad and it's terrifying because I don't feel safe and I'm sure a lot of women do not feel safe so we need to stop policing women and we need to start policing men we need to stop creating lists of things that women ought to do stop telling women that they should be home at a certain time wear a certain clothing item or not wear something go this place with certain friends don't go by yourself don't post certain pics on social media why must we always be so reactive let's be proactive and talk to men and boys let's tell them how to respect women let's have some social reform the society needs to change the public transportation system needs to change because this woman was taking a taxi to go home and she lost her life. She never made it home. We need to stop having sex offenders roaming the streets, men with over 70 charges to their name, being allowed bail and roaming the streets. Why is that a thing in 2021? We need to make the sex offenders list updated and public so that everyone can have access to it. So if I see this strange man, who could be a regular looking man, he could be looking very upstanding in society. And I could be curious about him. My energy could be off because my energy and my intuition is really ever wrong. And I should have the opportunity to research this man on the sex offender list to just be sure, you know, because you never know. Because we're not safe out here. I just want to have a moment of silence for Andrea Barat, for Shanti Riley, for all the women that went before, for all the women that lost their lives before they even started to live. So let's just take a moment of silence to remember them, a moment to send light to their families that are still living and have to go through and live through this devastation to their friends, their co-workers, anybody that had the privilege to interact with them. Just send light, send strength. Say their names.
I started this channel with the intention of sending out positivity and light and I feel it's even more imperative now more so than ever that I continue to do so. So I hope you enjoy this vlog footage that you're about to see from my birthday. I have some more footage coming soon because I did have some time, I did spend some time in Tobago last week while I was on vacation. So look forward to that and that's it ladies stay safe men do better please i'm begging Wow. 